I decided to stay here the holiday weekend. Yesterday, my mama and I had a good time. It was tainted a little bit. My mom and I were shopping at Macy's. I was in the dressing room trying on this beautiful top. Um, regular ones. I haven't taken the tab off of it yet. Do you mind if I got one? And I'm like, no, if you want to. She's like, nah, I'm gonna get what you get. I'm like, get it warm. I'm gonna remind her about the purple top last time that we both got the same thing. Um, $40 on sale for. 24, it was 40% off. And then, got the wow pass the lady gave to us, even though we didn't actually have one. So, got it for $20. Good deal. And my mom also got me some Levi shorts. You couldn't use the discount on them, but they were Fifty dollar shorts on sale for twenty five. Remember, this is all stuff. You know, she bought a whole bunch of stuff for herself too, and it's stuff she puts on her credit card. You know. Marion will be none the wiser that she puts stuff, small amount on her credit card for me, that my mom did. And then those lovely $13 Walmart shorts, the short ones that I bought, I was telling her that I couldn't find the ones that I wear all the time, that I bought two years ago, they're size 12, and it doesn't make sense, but it does. The 12 was too small and the same brand and the same, but a different kind of shorts, the same fate of glory. The 14s fit me, but the test is when I went out walking on them, even though they fit me, they still fit me kind of differently, and if they go up the crotch, I can't stand it. So I asked my mom if she wanted to buy those off of me. I told her, you don't have to, because I know you have limited cash or whatnot. But she did get $30 for her birthday, and she didn't use it. She saved it for a rainy day. I mean, she got that pedicure manicure, but she put it on her credit card, you know. Smart thinking, Mama. She decided to buy the shorts off me. I haven't even washed them in the warm months. She didn't have to. I asked her if she wanted to. And you can say, well, why didn't you just give them? Because I'm not going to just give them to her. They're, 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 she's rich compared to me now. She's rich compared to me. And in the end, like I said, what her sister is getting away with doing to me is sickening. And when I thought she wasn't, when I thought I was rich compared to her, I was buying stuff left and right. Not buying stuff for her, but I mean, I bought her the $250 vacuum, I bought a toaster and blender, I bought her pants, I, you know, when I first moved in, and I also was paying for everything, that's how she was saving up that $125 every week. I'm 
perhaps my several hundred receipts I could I could figure it out exactly, but I know my common sense tells me if she was saving up thousands under her mattress not touching the one twenty five that means and she normally would use the whole thing then 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 I was paid her the equivalent of a small amount of rent. At least like four hundred dollars a month. So I I'm not gonna, you know it's just such a joke. If she wants the shorts, she didn't have to buy them off me. I asked her, I said, do you want to, you know? It's not like they're real expensive, they're like $13. Just think of all the fucking anxiety this is causing me. Even just yesterday. I'm in the dressing room trying on my shirt, right? My mom comes in. She's like, you're not going to believe it. That woman's out there. What woman? Marion Spy. Yeah, from what I learned the other day, this woman who my mom was never friends with. And my mom doesn't like. Saw my mom walking angel and said, Oh, Samantha, how you doing? Whatever. And then, like, Oh my God, Mom, we can't even escape at the damn mall. Can't even, you know, go shopping and see a movie in peace. You know? So she had me sneak out, and of course, I was so. F I, I, I was telling him, like, this, this drives me to drink. Mom, this is a joke. And this is just a joke. It's a joke. Because this is, this is a woman who lives in this park and is friends with Marion. You know? And if she saw... Oh, and then Marion. Marion doesn't usually bother with my mom, of course. Marion called my mom yesterday night when she was at the mall, but when she was waiting for the bus. Coming to meet me. So I went ahead of her. I actually took a bus first somewhere else. And I wound up buying two camera memory things at Best Buy. Um, the sign said $25 and they were actually wearing up 20 I got the last two in the store. They were like $20 each and the rate was 70 each. The third um, remember, I, I can't erase them like I could when I have my own computer, when I had my own computer. Then they're saved onto my hard drive. When they're not saved onto my hard drive, I'm not going to erase them. It's just like there's no guarantees in life. There's no guarantee that, you know, just like we can be here today, gone tomorrow. My YouTube channel can be here today, gone tomorrow, you know. I want to make sure I have all my videos. So I have to keep buying camera memory. And I'm not, luckily I haven't ever, I wouldn't do it anyway. But, you know, I have paid $70. I guess I've gotten these 32 gigabytes, you know, cheap. Like on sale, like major sale. Last few times I've bought this months. So yeah, I have to run. And then I, I, I said, all right, I'll, I'll slip away. She, she kept freaking out to see if the woman was still there. I'm just like, she, and she felt the same way. She's like, why does this woman have to be here and ruin our day? I'm like, mom, this is a joke. How much more can I sum it up? And then my mom, I was going to meet her at the food court in that mall, and of course, after the woman did her shopping, the woman was sitting down, my mom said, but I was rude to that woman, she, she said, asked me if I wanted to eat with her, and I said, no, I'm busy, I was like, oh my God, I don't care, mom's such a joke, you know, big brother. The thing is, that woman could see me walking around here, you know. I ate so much yesterday, so many sweets. I didn't have time to get. I was. I, I didn't. I was. I didn't want to eat anything in the food court, so I wanted to get cookies. A couple of cookies at Subway, and saw the movie. And after the movie, we went and got the clothes that we had on. Hold Macy's. I 
Mine came to much more than hers did because she got all sales. But that's good. She got all discount stuff. And I had her buy me this one nice outfit. Um, I shouldn't, she wanted to, you know. Anytime she spends any money on me, from the credit card, not from the little $25 a month cash she gets now, you know. But like I said, she wanted to buy the shorts and she did get the extra for her birthday. She doesn't get any of her mail. She wanted to get Netflix, me to sign up for Netflix, so she, and I'm like, Mom, you can't get Netflix if Marion's getting all your mail now. And I wonder why Marion even has to get all her mail. Marion used to just get the major stuff. You know, she'd get anything that had to do with the 401k or the bank account or whatnot. And why is she getting all your mail now? Well, she did that while I was in the hospital. Well, why don't you change it back? Well, she's afraid to. You know, just more for control, Marion, you know. Marion's getting all her fucking mail. Imagine how I felt yesterday around this nice time and I have to worry because someone in this park was there. Why does she have to be here? My mom, it's the weekend. You know, what do you expect? It's the weekend. It's a mall. People do that. They go to the mall on the weekend. People go... Malls have, malls have movie theaters. I'm like, what if she's, you know... Most mall, even when I was visiting Joe, I went to the mall and had a movie theater, you know. So people do on the weekend, Mom. I can't ever, yeah. Because we're living in a friggin' Twilight Zone ridiculous reality, Mom. It upsets me. My mom says to me last night, I think we've been discussing that, that hideous looking mold growth thing on my ass. I'm going to the doctor's first thing tomorrow. I'm s tomorrow I'm going to the doctor's. To a different mall far away. I need to put bra. Doctors in a different mall, Pepra. I went to the store. It's Cutler. I was going to see if we get it. Yeah, well, I have to be at 12 and wake up at 3 30. We expect. I have no trouble. I fall asleep within a minute. I must fall asleep fast, but I don't sleep through the night ever. Ever. Last night, I'm watching, um, rented from Redbox. On the way home from the mall, we got drive, we stopped at the store. I had her put food and stuff on her credit card for us, food for us to eat, for dinner, for whatever. We had organic food. Today, I'm... I had her buy organic vegetables, and I have I have my black bean spaghetti that she tried the other night with olive oil and some sachet and geo and the Himalayan crystal salt. She loved them. And mom, this is just black beans. I don't know how they make it into spaghetti. That's crazy, huh? And and she's like, I love it. I'm like, I know. I tried it at Joe's, and he wasn't crazy about it, but I liked it, so I ordered it online from Vitacost. And I didn't know what was in it, but I looked on the ingredients. I'm like, Mom, all this is is black beans. How do they make black beans into spaghetti? There's no other ingredients. Black beans, how do they do that? It's a mystery. So we were, my mom and I were discussing this thing on my ass, and Yeah, Mom, it's definitely grown. Baker has definitely changed. It could be cancer. 
I'm not saying that to upset her or anything. And then one, she's like, she's like, Laura, you know how she is, and I have a child. Laura, p promise me you won't let anything happen to you. I couldn't stand it if anything ha bad happened to you. I'm like, Mom, I can't promise that. I didn't even say, Mom, I can't promise that I ignored her. Because it's such a ridiculous thing for her to be saying that it, it doesn't even warrant an answer from your reply back. Like, I can't promise that, Mom. Well, you... And cause first, she, first she said, you, you, you call me the second you know anything. But it's bad news. Don't leave a message. I'm like, what do you mean? You don't want to hear on the phone. Then you won't find out for over a week. I'm not coming back here for over a week. And... She's like, no, I just want to know, not in a message, I want you to tell me, talking to me over the phone, like, okay. Okay, Mom. Hopefully it's not bad news, but, you know, I can get cancer just like anybody else, and I'm on, I've been under a fucking obscene amount of stress. And remember, I don't want to be here. So, I'm fully aware the universe could decide to give me what I want, you know? what I think I want, but it's, it's complicated, but it's still true. I don't care for this existence at all, and I'm a misfit. I'm, I'm a misfit. I watched an adult world last night. Redbox, we ordered, I got us Gravity, my mom saw that in the theater, but I wanted to, I, w we, I was supposed to watch that with Bobby, because he likes Sandra Bullock, but we never wanted to watch, and he got a girlfriend, and I never, pretty much never saw him, we yeah, mostly you know, I hardly ever saw him anymore, so I want to see Gravity, and the, it had this thing where you see an extra movie for 20 cents, a dollar off the first day, I'm like, Mom, I'm gonna get Adult World. What's that? Well, you don't have to watch it if you don't want to. I'll watch it early, and then we'll watch Gravity later, but... Her dog, Angel, has to go interrupt the movie 50 million times to go and pee, and then... By the time we watch anything... Um... But I had decided to go on a 50-minute, really intense power walk. Um... try to combat all the sweets I had, I had chowed down on during the day. I got those two cookies at Subway afterwards. I, I bought a Dunkin' Donut coffee colada. Um, and a lemon donut. I wanted that delicious blueberry donut that I tried before this Dunkin' Donut didn't have it though. Um, lemon donut didn't float my boat. But I'm just saying all these sweets that I had. The Dunkin' Donuts coffee colada, the donut, the two cookies. And after the movie at the food court, my mom and I... My mom got us each a slice of pizza. The good kind that it sat there, like a good pizza place. Oh, it was vegetarian pizza. It was so good. <clears throat> and it, she got a drink and the two slices of pizza and it came to nine something like... I'm being sarcastic. I'm always being sarcastic with it. This Mary and fucking shit that makes me want to pull up my hair as I told my mom right yesterday. Um, makes me want to drink or pull up my hair. Something that's ridiculous. And big brother, I have to hide from somebody who Mary knows in this park who could be marrying one of Mary's spies. Ugh. Fucking ridiculous. Anyway, my mom bought us pizza and it was delicious pizza. And the bill came to nine, so I'm like, I'm teasing or being sarcastic. Won't, mom, my, won't she know, Mom, if it comes to this? My mom was smart. She's like, no. You know, I could be getting for my dinner up to two slices of pizza. I'm like, I know, Mom. I'm just being, you know, and I'm instigating. I like to instigate when it comes to this freaking ridiculous Marian shit. I, I got a lot, I did eat sweets and stuff yesterday, because then at the store we stopped at, we got a Newman's own organic mint dark chocolate, okay, so I had a lot of sweets, we had it all up, but I didn't eat lunch, the two, oh no, I, I did eat lunch, I got that slice, one slice of pizza after the movies, 
but she had gone to Dunkin' Donuts and had lunch, and then she had that pizza, and then we ate the stuff last night. We had organic cottage cheese and these that she bought. I had her buy for us to have for dinner, and the black bean chips. They were really good, and they have a lot of fiber in them, so they're really good dipped in the cottage cheese. Um, we, like, split that bag and split the cottage cheese, and... I went for a 50-minute, really intense power walk where I held my stomach in the 